Hello everyone and welcome to my true crime channel. I hope you're all well and having a great day. So today I want to discuss with you guys just where is Grandus. So I've been wondering lately where is Summerwell's grandmother aka Grandus and I heard something extremely interesting on a video on YouTube recently. It was on Doug's channel and that is Um No Thanks Investigates. He had Don B, a fellow YouTuber on, and Cam and Ali from Cracking Cases, who also run a YouTube channel. In this particular video, Don B asked Cam, where is Grandus? And Cam's answer was really interesting. He didn't seem to want to say. Cam said that he's not able to discuss what he's seen or heard at the Wells family home, and that he signed some sort of disclaimer to keep quiet. Wow, if that's true, that's quite shocking in my opinion. Why is it that Don and Candace don't want us to know where Grandis is? Why is Grandis so elusive? Why do we never hear from her? And why has she disappeared again? So I've always found it very weird that one of the main people that was there when five-year-old Summer Wells disappears, her grandmother, has hardly ever spoken out. She disappeared off the scene and, according to Don, got well away from all the drama and apparently apparently, went to stay with her sister to help with her brother-in-law, who apparently was unwell. I'm not sure that I've ever bought that story, and apparently Grandma, or Grandus, recently returned to her trailer at the Wells family home, and according to some people, she's gone again. So where has she gone? I can't say that I know, because I haven't got a clue, but it would seem that Cam from Cracking Cases does know, but he's not allowed to say. How weird is that? So what do you think, guys? Where do you think Grandis is? Why do you think that she never sticks around for long? I've often thought it's because her and Don don't get on. Or maybe it's not just because she doesn't get on with Don Wells. Maybe it's because Grandis really knows what happened to Summer and she doesn't want to let the truth slip out. So I'm going to play you a little snippet now so you can hear what Cam from Cracking Cases said to Doug and Don B. So then I, so I found this after, and I'll read this one to you. I don't know how to work her phone. She's going to have to get it faster. She's smart. She's like, get a phone. He doesn't she, know she, she likes Android. <laughs> I like iPhone. So hey, while, while they're doing that, I do got a question for you. Yeah. Um, is Grandis back? I see. I signed. This is the thing about that. I signed something up there that I can't talk about. Uh, being on the property, who's there or anything, and I, I can't break that, and I would. I can tell I can tell you that I met her before, and that she's real. That she she came across as a nice person. That's all I, that I can really talk about. Okay. Yeah, we were trying to because everybody's saying she's back, and some people are saying like she left again, and we were just trying to figure that out. So what do you think to that, guys, whether you heard it live on Doug's channel or whether it's the first time that you're hearing it now? Do you think, like me, that it's really weird that there's such a mystery surrounding Grandma or Grandus? And where is she? I have to say, I find it really weird that people can't talk about Grandma or Grandus. Is there some kind of gag order on people talking about Grandma? There is a gag order on the Wells talking about their sons that are currently in foster care. But it would seem, in my opinion... And as always, guys, it is just my humble opinion that maybe there's a gag order on everyone talking about grammar. So could Summer's case get any more bizarre? There have been so many twists and turns over the past couple of weeks, over the past five months. Don and Candace on Dr. Phil recently. Wasn't that the eye-opener? And Don Wells appearing on YouTube, mostly on a daily basis, and mostly on a daily basis, kicking off with the hosts of the channels that he appears on. So I do wonder what's next in the case for Summer Wells. I really would love to see Candace interrogated or spoken to by herself. That doesn't appear to ever happen because I don't think Don likes to let Candace speak out in case she lets the truth slip out. And even more, would I love to hear from Grandis. Wouldn't it be great if she had sat down with Dr. Phil? I did wonder why she hadn't appeared. And I do wonder if we're ever going to hear Grandma's version of events. Do you think it's really weird that no one can talk about Grandus? Do you think it's really weird that she's disappeared once again? And do you think, like me, that maybe Grandus really knows what happened to Summer? So share your thoughts with me, guys. As always, I want to know what you think. So please pop your comments below. Let me know if you think this is weird. Why do you think there's such a mystery surrounding Grandus? 
Do you think Don and Candace are covering for her in some way? We all know that Don and Candace's mother do not get on, but why would Don cover for her if they don't get on? This is such a weird situation that just keeps getting weirder every day. Well, anyway, guys, I will look forward to reading your thoughts and views on this. As always, I hope you're keeping well and having a good day. And as always, I'm going to be back with you all very soon for another true crime video. Bye for now.